welcome back to my channel. I've been getting a lot of people asking to help them with some healthy, affordable meals. Um, some of you are in college or some of you have kids and um, you have to make dinner or meals for your husband and your children, for your family. Um, I totally, totally get that because eating healthy can get expensive, which I don't understand why, but I guess it's easier and more cost effective to make crappy food. But I totally get that. I usually have about the same thing every day, but sometimes like I'll be experimental. For today's video, I've got two different chicken recipes. One was inspired by Fit With ASD, which she is Grace from A Southern Draw. I know you guys have heard me mention her before in another video. And then, um, the other one is just basically something that I do on a regular basis. I'll make it on Sunday. So I'll just do it and then I'll freeze it and have it for the whole week. And it's easy to make, like, do different things with it, which is great when you're on a budget and when you have a big family. Um, you can just make the protein and it's so easy to make like sides and, and veggies to go with it. So that is a huge way of doing um, cost effective and also buying in bulk. I either go to Costco or BJ's, I don't know if you have one of those in your hometown or Sam's Club as well. Um, and I just buy like the big chicken. It might, and it, in the long run, it's so much more cost effective because you're getting more bang for your buck. So without further ado, let's get to it. I kind of went ahead and got a head start. So this is a chicken that I buy. Um, it's about, just to say, I want to say it's like about four pounds maybe? Three pounds. It's three pounds of ground bean chicken. I'm going to go ahead and wash my hands here. What I use is this criollo, which you can find here in Miami because it's very Latin inspired like everything here is Latin. But if you don't have this in your hometown, which I'm sure probably you don't, do not fret because you can use regular salsa. It'll do the same thing. So for my next meal, this is the one that's in, uh, inspired by a Southern Drawl. She uses 16 ounces of chicken and a little hack is that you can buy rotisserie chicken so it's already cooked, you don't have to waste any time um, and save some money. So you just kind of just get it and that's it. Or you can make your own chicken, whichever one you prefer. Um, and then she calls it her crack chicken. I did a little bit of adjustments to it. That's why I'm giving her credit. Um, but it's super easy because the sauce that goes with the chicken, you can store it in the fridge and use it for whatever, even the other chicken that I showed you, the ground chicken that I do on a daily basis. You can do it on turkey, you can put it on toast, you can put it on eggs, you can do like an egg scramble. The list goes on and it's great because you've got that, it lasts for a while for you and it's full of protein and it's really healthy and it's a great, great way to always have something in the fridge so whenever you're hungry you just grab it, go eat and you're not tempted to order in. Now this calls for bacon, um, turkey bacon. You can also use ham or regular sliced turkey and you don't have to worry about cooking the bacon or you can just completely omit the bacon and it's still going to be just as delicious if you're vegetarian or you just don't want to have the bacon. One cup. And one teaspoon of onion powder. Salt. Store in a jar, this is a mason jar. 